Hello, good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you guys? Hi. Great, great. Okay. Good evening, teacher. Hey. Great for now. Good mundo. Great. Okay, okay. We're about to start. Okay, let's start the class because we cannot wait for the others. Um, let's review really quick the midterm section. I hope you were able to perform the midterm exam, which is on your platform. I think I think this audio, yeah, this audio cannot be played here. So I will be jumping, I will be skipping, skipping the, the audios, if you don't mind. Okay, let's go with the second section, section B of the midterm. Um, you need to finish up the WH question where it's according to the correspondence, good to the response given. You can choose lo long, good, often, well, okay. So here you have to choose one of these words, right? To go here. So how long, good, often, well do you work out? The answer is every day. I mean a real fit I'm a real fitness freak. What's the answer here? How often? How often, right? Good. Okay. Now I don't need a period or a comma or a capital letter. I'm sorry, there's a lot of noise. Thank you, thank you. Okay, so next, number two. I was saying that I don't need a capital letter here. No, I don't need a comma or a period. It's just the word, okay? Next, how... Good, long, often, well, do you play tennis? The answer is about average, but I'm getting better and better. Well. How well? Okay. How well do you play tennis? About average. Okay, everybody, come on, guys. Number three. How long, good, often, or well do you spend at the gym? The answer is just 30 minutes a day. Who has the time? How long? How long? How long? How long? Yeah, 30 minutes, right? 30 minutes. Makes sense. Okay, how long? Number four, how long, good, well, often are you at soccer? How good. How good. Okay, good job. How good are you at soccer? Okay, I guess. It's not really my favorite sport. Okay, here you just have to choose an option between stay, stayed, between did, do, so the past or the present of the of the verb. Did you stay, stayed home last night? Exactly, yeah, stay. Remember that the verb goes on simple present is a question, right? Same on the, the same on the second one. What did you do? What do you do? What do you do? Exactly. What do you do? Okay. okay. Um, this is a positive sentence. So the verb needs to go in past. What is the past for go? When? When? Excellent. Good job. Okay. Really? Oh, really? Okay. Yes, we have had a great time. Oh. Had, right? Yeah. Where? The past of B, U. What's yeah. the answer? Where were you exactly? Number six, the past of B. Okay. I was, right? I was. Good job. Actually, no, I met my friends there. We spent, spent, spend it. Spend. And spend. Uh, uh, Let's see. Yeah. 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 Everything's good. Go with the next one. 
Let's choose the correct answer. Um, excuse me, is there a gas station near here? Yes, there is. There's any one or some around the corner. One. There's one. Good job. Okay. How not much? How many or how a few hotels are there in this neighborhood? How many? How many, right? Yeah. Because it's plural, so I need the, for the plural. Many. Good job. There are a little much a few how many hotels a few there are a few okay is there much many or one public transportation near here much okay is mm -hmm. there much public transportation near here much uncountable can we count the public transportation no okay no there isn't one any or none There isn't any. Okay. Yep. You got it. Good job. We're almost done. Number three. Put the words in the correct order to make sentences or questions. Dinner off and TV I watch after. Let me help you. I. I often watch TV after dinner. Excellent. Good job. I often watch TV after dinner. I want to leave this with a period. Let me see if it doesn't give us an error. Number two, in you coffee, do it. They do drink ever evening. <laughs> it's a question. <clears throat> if it is a question, we have simple present. What comes first on a question? Do you ever drink coffee? Do you ever drink coffee? Mm -hmm. Evening. And the evening. And the evening. Excellent. Do you ever drink coffee in the, in the evening. evening? The question. The question mark. Question mark. Very good. And the last one. Very doesn't Jeff much exercise. Jeff doesn't very much exercise. Hmm. Think about it. Jeff. Yes, doesn't. doesn't exercise very much. Mm -hmm, exactly. Jeff doesn't exercise very much. This is a negative sentence, right? Jeff doesn't exercise very much. Let's see. Okay, the period at the end doesn't go. It's not applicable. Okay. There you go. It's just a period at the end. Okay, and number four was just a reading. And then you have the true statements. Okay. So let me see if I can just open it. Oh my God, this is not, I won't be able to see it. Wow. Ber okay, uh, dear Ted, Berkeley is a great city. I really like it here. There's always lots of, lots to do. Every day after class, I walk down Telegram, Telegraph Avenue. I always like to go to my favorite coffee shop in the afternoon and meet my friends there for coffee. In the evening, there is always something interesting to do in town or near the university. For example, I sometimes see a foreign movie or listen to live music. On Saturday, my friends and I usually take the bus to San Francisco for the day. I love the shops and restaurants, and it's a great city for jogging or inline skating. I'm really getting good at it. I'm really getting good at it, good at it. In Golden Gate Park, we always go to Chinatown to have lunch, and then we go walking or shopping in the afternoon. On Sunday, sometimes I like to play tennis with friends 
or we watch a sports event like a football game or a basketball game on TV. I think American football is very exciting. Well, that's all for now. Take care. Hope to hear hope to hear from you soon. Love Ruth. Okay. That's the reading. Let me see if I can just skip this here. Yeah. So she walks down Telegraph Avenue every day after class. True or false? I think that was true. I, let me try to remember. She meets her friends for coffee in the evening. Hmm. Right. False. Okay. She sometimes dances to live music. False. Right. False. Okay. She enjoys going to San Francisco on the weekend. No, they travel to San Francisco, right? By bus every after every day. No. She doesn't like inline skating. It's taking this is misspelled. I think that's true. She does no, she doesn't like no, she is false because she says she's getting good at it. She's getting good at it. She goes shopping or walking after lunch on Saturdays. True. That's true. She plays tennis with friends every Sunday. Yeah. yeah. She likes to watch football and basketball on TV. I think she said she, she does. Okay. No. Okay. So this was false. She plays tennis with friends every Sunday. Okay. And here she enjoys going to San Francisco on the weekend. Mm -hmm. Okay. That was true. Okay. okay. These were the answers. I hope you can check this video. If you haven't finished your midterm, this is a good time to do it. Don't forget to do it, please. Today we start lesson four. Um, let's start with the video, word power, appearance. Appearance. Let's learn some vocabulary on how to describe people, if I'm not mistaken. Let's take a look. Hi, welcome to section nine. In this section, you will learn vocabulary to describe people. Look at the following pictures and repeat the adjectives of appearance after me. Hair, long brown hair. Sorry, just a minute. Hair. Short blonde hair, straight black hair, curly red hair, bald a mustache and a beard, age, young, middle-aged, elderly, looks, handsome, good-looking, pretty, height, short, fairly short, medium height, pretty tall, very tall. Okay, it's just a practice of vocabulary. Look at the following pictures and repeat the adjectives of appearance. After okay, so what we're doing here is learn new vocabulary on describing people. First, we have the hair appearance. The hair appearance. We have long hair, long hair. I'm sorry, long brown hair. Long, long brown. brown hair. Short blonde hair short blonde hair okay straight black hair straight black hair curly red hair it could be curly black curly brown hair okay bold bold it's not bald it's bold okay a mustache, mustache, and beard. Now, this word, this word has similar sounds that I would like to point out. So you have bear, be careful. You have beard, uh -uh, beard. Then you have beard, and then you have what you like, beer, right? Can you see this little chart? I'm going to put it here. Okay, so look at that little chart here. You have bear, also, right? Bear. Bear. You have bared. Bared. And here you have beard. Beard. 
and beer. Beer. Again, bear, beard. Beard, beer. So there's a V sound in bird and beard, but not in bear and beer. Hope you got it. It's a pronunciation tip. Okay, moving on. So now we have age, talking about how old somebody looks, because you cannot describe someone, but like the age, the exact age, right? She's like 20 years old, yeah. But it's better if you say young, okay? The, te the teacher looks young, but he is middle-aged, middle aged middle middle aged aged elderly okay elderly this is old people somebody is very old elderly okay again young middle aged aged elderly how someone look how do you look how does she look handsome he handsome for men and women for men i'm sorry we use handsome for men handsome for both men and women men and women we use good looking she is good looking he is good looking okay and for women we use pretty pretty can i say beautiful yes yes you can say beautiful but that's I mean, that's very uh, beautiful. It's like someone very pretty, right? A, a woman, a woman, sorry. Uh, next, height. Somebody's height. Is he or she short? Short. Fairly short. What is fairly short? What do you think is fairly short? Pequeño. Yeah, but this is pequeño. This is short. What about fairly, fairly short? Median. Uh huh. A medium, medium size, right? That's right. But this is medium height. Medium height. This is like the average, okay? Average. Okay. Fairly short is a man or a woman of 150, maybe. 150 and less than 150 that's short now pretty tall pretty tall it's more than medium <laughs> and very tall is someone like two meters you know like two meters and above oh, yeah uh-huh pretty tall is like the standard for example me i'm pretty tall i'm 176 i'm 176 i'm pretty tall but someone, a man, for example, in 160, 165, that's medium high. 155 or so is fairly short. And below 150 is short. What other words or expressions do you okay. know to describe someone? Do you know any other words? <laughs> Chobi. Chobi. Good. Chobi is like fat, but it's like fat in all of his body or her body. It's all the body, right? Okay. Fat. Fat is is more um, a little irrespectful. A little irrespectful to call somebody fat. It's really fat. Uh huh. The opposite. What will be the opposite for chubby or fat? How do you call that thing that you use when you paint? When you paint with oil paint, what do you use to reduce the paint? You use thinner, right? Thinner, right? So thin. Thinner. <laughs> Uh-huh. Adelgazador. Yeah, thinner. Uh-huh. That's right. Thin, delgado. Right? What else? 
What else do you know? Skinny. Skinny. <laughs> yeah. Man, Skinny is like in his bones. In his bones, right? Only bones. Okay. Any other? What is the opposite of uh, beautiful or pretty or or handsome? What's the opposite? Ugly. Ugly. Good job. What else? What else? What about the skin? Beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, yeah. I was saying that you can call a woman. You can call a woman beautiful, right? That's all right. What about the skin color? Black. Mm, no, we don't use black. Same. You can say brown. Brown. Brown skin. skin. Brown skinned. Brown skinned. Um, nunca digan negro, o sea, black skin, or yellow skin. Okay, to Asian Asian people don't call yellow uh, to an Asian. That's irrespectful. Um, and red. Also, yellow is uh, some someone who has a. Uh, uh, I would say afraid. Yeah. Yellow. Afraid? Mm. No, but Asian people, you know, Chinese people don't like to be called yellow. As well as native native Canadians. Indios, okay, Na native Canadians, they don't like to be called red skin. Okay, red skin, uh uh. So brown skin, uh, white skin, etc. Okay. Um, and in the middle, somebody who is not brown is not white. You can call them. Um, oh my God! I forgot the word. I forgot how to say trigueño in English. Can't believe it. Ten. Tan, oh, well, that's another one. Tan is, is uh, bronceado, right? Anyways, I'll remember. Okay, um, good. I think this, oh, you can talk about the color of the eyes, right? You can say she has. Now, I think on the next lesson, we're going to learn how to describe someone using the verb to be or has or have, which is very useful as well. I'll send you this to your WhatsApp right now so we can have some practice really quick on pronunciation. This is just pronunciation, guys. Don't get stressed. Okay, we are, we are 19 so far, 18. Okay, so there you have on your WhatsApp the image, which is also on your platform. Let me just check really quick. And yes, we then we have a conversation. Later on, we will practice. Uh huh. Which one is she? Which one is he? Okay, good. So let's practice this. Um, the pronunciation of these words just for six minutes. It's going to be really quick. So on your groups, make sure you practice the pronunciation, okay? This will be just very short, six minutes, and we come back. Let's go.
eso, sí. Sí. You are gray hair. ¿Ya? Yeah. Oh, you are bald. Pelomba, pelomba. Sí. And most time, and beer? I, I don't have most oh, times hey. and, and beer. Yeah. Sí. But I have a gray hair. Yeah. Hey. Look. Watch. Yeah. Hey, hey. Is correct, teacher? Teacher, gray hair? Yes, the color of the hair. Uh huh. Silver hair. Silver. Silver, Silver hair, sí. canoso, ajá. Silver hair. Gray? No. Man, you can say gray, yeah. Okay. Wow. He's showy. Sí. He's showy. Elderly. Eh, elderly. Ah, no. Elderly. You, you, you are elderly. Elderly. I'm, I'm, I'm not handsome. Elderly. I'm elderly. I'm handsome. <laughs> Handsome. Ya no le ya, 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 you are a very short. You very tall. Very tall, but. Tall. Cama larga. Cama larga. Short, but very tall. Okay. What else? Okay. And a little fat. Show it. So. What else? And we're going to see Marilu Urdes. Good evening. Hi. My hair, my hair is um, curly, black. Um, long hair. Long hair. Black and curly. And blonde. Black and blonde. Or just black? black? Curly. Curly? Blonde? Cur curly, black. Black. And long. <laughs> no. Uh, um, long. Maybe long. Curly. I hate black. Mm, I am medium medium height. Medium medium height. Medium height. Yes. I'm sorry. And about the age. Mm. Hmm? John. Middle middle age. Middle, middle. age. Uh, uh, Peter, good looking. ¿Qué significa? Me, 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 me. Bien parecido. Uh, good looking. Good me, looking. Me, me. Good looking. Uh -huh. me, me, me. Good looking. Uh, good looking. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, he is good looking. I'm handsome. <laughs> handsome, and guapo. Okay, good. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. Handsome. Maybe. Uh, 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 teacher, can I can I say uh, uh, Maria is breathtaking woman? Is a breathtaking? It's a woman? breathtaking Taking... woman. Yes. Yes. yes, yes, but that's not respectful. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I, mean... I know. Okay. And, uh, and, and Eber Gallego is ugly. Yeah. Oh no! Don't say that. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's a. <laughs> You have a mustache and beard. Hi, Mr. Bobby. You have a mustache and beard. 
What's the meaning, teacher? How do you say? Barba? Beard? Beard. 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 Uh -huh. Your microphone. Excuse me. <laughs> beer. Um, I am. Um, I know beer. 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 We bear. You are down. Excuse me, Mister. Uh, Arias, I am not listening. Are you? Hola. Hola, ¿qué tal? Hello, good evening. Que yo acabo Hello. de ingresar. Eh. A ver qué pasó. It's just, it was just pronunciation. Solo era de practicar la pronunciación del de vocabulario que está ahí en el WhatsApp. Ok, gracias. Ok. Quiero ver el WhatsApp. Yo no tengo... Veamos. Ay, mm -hmm. Uy, cansado de la tatita. Mm -hmm. Ay, yo vi, vi al sargento Rosales, pero no está, ¿verdad? Se salió quizá. Espérame, Mónica. Voy a buscar el, sí, el, yo voy. el otro. Y yo con el teléfono okay. estoy, por ejemplo. Veamos. Okay, so how many are we back? Yes, we're back. Let me do the attendance. Adan Iglesias Velasquez. Okay, éramos 18, ya somos 15. No, he is in practice uh, okay. for the okay. float of September. Yeah. Thank you. Arles Ernesto Lopez. Baudilio de Nilsson Rivera Ramírez. Present teacher. Thank you. Carlos Alberto Santos Reyes. Carlos Edgardo Cruz González. Cecia Gemima Ortiz Núñez. Present teacher. Thank you. David Antonio Rosales García. Okay, ahí está David. Thank you. Edith Consuelo Represa Toledo. Present teacher. Thank you. Edmundo Antonio Martínez Lucha. Present teacher. Good. Enrique Pérez Lemus. 
audience. Erika Beatriz Guillén Pineda. Teacher. Erika is sick. Okay. Thank you, Odie. Ever Enrique Gallegos Mejía. Present, teacher. Thank you. Ever Francis Alvallero. Franklin present, de la O. Present, oh, teacher. Ever, Aquí con problemas. You. Alvallero, presente. Thank you. Problem. Franklin de la O. Ayala Hernández. Present, teacher. Thank you. Herbert Aristides Oya Ruiz. José Amilca Reyes Cruz. José Benjamín Gavidia Guevara. Gracias, teacher. Hoy ya se reportó en el WhatsApp que no se iba a conectar. Ok. Juan Carlos Portillo Arias. Gracias, present teacher. Thank you. Juan Francisco Arrazabal Calderón. Presente, teacher, presente. Okay. Karen Julisa Vázquez de Aparicio. Teacher, presente. Thank you, Juan Francisco. Ya por cómo me ha dejado a mí y no puedo regresar. María de Lourdes, Miroslava Mansur Aguilar. Present, teacher. María Magdalena Cedillos González. Mónica Ivette Merino Rivas. Present, teacher. Present. Thank you. Thank you. Oscar okay. Susana Castellano. Santos Mauricio Arias Valle. Mr. Santos is there. Saúl Ernesto Martínez Portillo. I am here, present teacher. Thank you, Santos. Saúl Ernesto Martínez Portillo. Okay. Wilber Rafael Rivas Arias. Present teacher. Good. And Salvador Manrique Hernández Vázquez. Good. Okay, let's continue. We have a conversation up next on your platform. Okay, let's go for the conversation. This is 4.3. The conversation is, she's very tall. She's very tall. Hello to all. In this lesson, you will listen to... I hear you have a new girlfriend, Randy. Okay, so I'm going to practice the pronunciation and leave this recorded again. So you can practice later. I will send you the video to your WhatsApp as well. Please make sure you practice. These uh, two lessons are just pronunciation. If you noticed, it's all about pronunciation. Okay, so we have... Yes. Just a minute, put this on HD, okay. So, Emily and Brandy. I hear you have a new girlfriend, Randy. Yes, her name's Ashley. Yes, her name's Ashley. And she's gorgeous. 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 Really? What does she look like? What does she look like? Well, she is very tall. She's very tall. How tall? How tall? About six feet two. About six feet two, I suppose. Wow, that is tall. What color, color is her hair? Hair, 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 hair. She has beautiful red hair. And how old is she? And how old is she? I don't know. I don't know. She won't tell me. She won't tell me. Okay, one more time. I hear you have a new girlfriend, Randy. Yes, her name's Ashley. And she's gorgeous. Really? 
What does she look like? Well, she's very tall. How tall? About six feet two, I suppose. Wow, that is tall. What color is her hair? She has beautiful red hair. And how old is she? I don't know. She won't tell me. Okay, let's have a practice here and then I will split you in breakout rooms. So let me choose someone here. Okay. <clears throat> Mr. Arias Valle and Maudilio. Will it be all right? Hello. Yeah. Oh. Hello, teacher. Yeah, let's practice with Santos. Maudilio? That I think I think Santos. Can you hear us? Yes. You are Emily with my audio teacher. My connection is bad. Okay, hold on then. Let me choose Monica, Yvette, are you there? Hola. Yes, Monica, can you practice? Yes. Okay. Okay. Okay, with with El Mundo. Let's go with El Mundo. The connection, the Santos connection is not good. Bien, bien. Okay. One, two, three, action. I hear you have Hannes Grilson Randy. Repeat, a new girlfriend. I, a new girlfriend. Girlfriend. Uh -huh. Randy. Good. Girl, girl friend. Good job. Good weather for Randy. Mm -hmm. El Mundo? Yes. Her name's Ashley and she is gorgeous. Really? Really? Or really? 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 What, the, what does she, she look like? She well, like... well, she's very tall. How tall? How tall? How tall? How tall? How tall? About six feet two, I suppose. Wow, that is tall. That is tall. Oh. That is tall. Como es, perdón? That, that is tall. That is tall. What color is her hair? Her hair. Her hair. Her hair. She has a beautiful red hair. And has, and has all. Is she? And how old is she? And how old is she? How old is she? <laughs> and how old? And how old is she? How is she? I don't know. She? she won't tell me. Good job. Okay, mm -hmm. I'll send you this conversation. Thank you, guys. Thank you very much. Thank you, teacher. Oh, thank you, Yvette. Thank I'll you. send you the, the conversation right now to your WhatsApp. Eh, si sí necesito que practiquen, por favor. No se queden en acá nadie y vamos a practicar todos juntos, okay? Just a minute. And by the way, gorgeous, gorgeous is very beautiful. I mean, it's really beautiful. Okay, that's the um, the meaning of gorgeous. Okay, so there you have. I'm going to split you right now. Please accept the invitation and practice with your classmates. Let's go.
Eh, aceptemos la invitación, por favor. Ahí tengo una compañera que está sola para practicar. Yo, teacher, pero estoy tratando de meterme al WhatsApp web porque no tengo como en el teléfono estoy, fíjese. Ah, ok. Trabajando. Ajá, pero sí le llegó la invitación al grupo. Sí, sí, me llegó. Okay. Sí, para que se pueda unir y, y nos vayamos de este grupo, para que se quede. Sí, sí lo que quiero. Tenga gracias, gracias. Ok, ok. Yes. Her name is Ashley. And she's George. Really? What does she look like? Well, she is very tall. How tall? About six feet two, I suppose. Wow, that is tall. What color is her hair? She has beautiful red hair. I'm sure. I'm how? Carlos, démosle. I heard you have a new girlfriend, Randy. Mr. Gavidia. Démosle nosotros. Bueno, yes, he, he made a and she Gorg, teacher. What is gorgeous? What is that? Gorgeous. 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 Yeah. Beautiful. Extremely beautiful. Oh. Okay. Thank you. Her name. Riley, really? What does she look like? Well, she's very tall. How tall? How she is she too? I think she walks about six feet two. I suppose. I suppose or suppose, teacher. Yeah. I suppose. I su suppose. Suppose. Whoa, that is dead. Tell or tell. She has beautiful very high. And how old is she? I don't know. She won't tell me. She won't. Tell me. Okay. Don't tell me. Okay. I am Maria from Virginia. Is this Maria? Maria. Uh -huh. Hi. And you. Okay. Well, she is very, very tall. How tall? About six feet two. Um, I suppose. Suppose. I suppose. 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 <laughs> Thank you. Suppose. Wow, that is tall. What color is her hair? Her hair. Her her, 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 hair. her hair. She has. She has beautiful red hair. Red hair. O sea, mi cabello rojo. Red oh, hair. She has. She hair. has beautiful red hair. Red hair. She has beautiful red hair. Hair. Red hair. Red hair. Um. Okay. Red hair. Bien. Vamos bien. And how old is she? I don't know. She won't tell me. I don't know. She won't not tell me. She won't tell me. Okay. She won't tell me. Okay. Voy de nuevo. 
I heard you have a new girlfriend, Randy. She won't tell me. She won't tell me. Uh, Cecilia, start it again. Go ahead. I heard you have a new girlfriend, yeah, Randy. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Her name's Ashley, and she's. Esa palabra siempre me cuesta. Gorgeous. 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 Muy bien. Gorgeous. Very good. Gorgeous. Okay. Gorgeous. Yes. Gorgeous. Her name is Ashley, and she's gorgeous. Really? What does she look like? Well, she's very tall. How tall? I would six feet two, and esta palabra me cuesta. I suppose. I suppose. I suppose. I suppose. I would Whoa, six... that... Bueno, siga, 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 Cecia, perdón. Wow, that is that is tall. What color is her hair? She has beautiful red hair. She oh, has red. beautiful red hair. Red hair. Red hair. Red hair. Red hair. Red. Red. Red hair. Okay. Um, how old is she? I don't know. I don't know. She won't. I don't know. She won't tell me. She won't tell me. She won't tell me. She won't tell me. I don't know. She won't tell me. Okay. Excellent. Gracias. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Entonces, lo que le quería compartir era de cómo lo he dejado. Aquí está, aquí está, aquí está. Vaya, practiquemos. Voy, 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 Mónica. I hear you have a new grand, grand friend, Randy. Yes, her, her name is. Her name is Ashley. And she's gorgeous. Gorgeous. Go Ay, está bien pendiente. Está bueno, teacher. Quiero aprender. ¿Cómo dijo? Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Solo es gorgeous. 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 Mm -hmm. Okay. Really? Really? What does she look like? Well, she's, she's, she is, no, she's very tall. Very tall. T tall, tall. Very tall. Very tall. Very tall. Very tall. Very tall. How? How tall? A book. Six. About about six two about six feet two. I suppose. I suppose. 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 Whoa. Whoa. Does is tall? What color is her high? Her hair. Her hair. Uh -huh. She her has hair beautiful. She has beautiful hair. Her hair. Her red hair. And what all is she? And how I, how old how old is she? How old? And how old is she? How old is she? How old is she? Okay. I how don't. Okay, I don't. You, you. She won't tell me. Tell me. Tell me. She won't tell me. <laughs> Ok, lucha, queremos escuchar cómo pronuncia usted. Practica. Vaya. 
Eh. Aquí no, tenés no, una colega, Lucha, aquí va a practicar una colega con vos, dice. Emily, vaya. Adelante, vaya. Emily. I hear you have a new girlfriend, Randy. Yes, her name is Ashley, and she's gorgeous. Really? What does she look like? Well, she's very tall. How tall? About six, six feet two, I suppose. Wow, that is tall. What color is her hair? She has a beautiful red hair. And how old is she? I don't know. She won't tell me. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> Very good. Me hace burla, mi hija. No, pero hable con, hable con ella. Ah, practique esta lectura con ella. Y luego cambian roles. Ajá. Así le digo, teacher, que me enseñe. You can do it. Okay, let's go back. Okay, guys, that's it for tonight. Thank you very much for joining me. Um, espero verlos mañana a la misma hora. Por favor, practiquen. Y si no han terminado el midterm, hay que terminar hasta el midterm. Hasta ahí vamos ya y empezamos con la unidad 4. Ok, uh, vamos a concluir el 20, si no me equivoco. Let me check really quick. Sí, eh, terminamos el 21 de septiembre, so... Solo nos queda prácticamente esta semana y hasta el jueves de la otra, ¿ok? See you Thank tomorrow. You. See you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Take care. Oh. See you tomorrow. Okay.